Hello everyone, this is Alex Bavalsik from HowToDoTech.com and today we're looking at picture in picture video on iMovie on the iPad. So say you're vid editing video on an iPad and you decide I want a clip to be playing inside another clip. I know it's crazy, but we're actually going to do it right now with picture in picture on an iPad. Now this is a pretty new feature. It wasn't available on iMovie on iPads till the newest version, so let's get right into it. So I already have a main clip in my project timeline, and I'm going to add in that selection clip up in my media adding area to my timeline. Now I'm going to tap on that selection up at the top, hit the three dots, and from here hit the icon that is second from the right, that's the picture-in-picture -picture icon. So now that I do that, it adds it right in, and now I can change some properties. First property that I obviously want to change is I want to proportionalize this so that it doesn't interfere with the shot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go up to a random spot, tap on the picture-in-picture, -picture, and then up in the preview area, I'm going to tap on the um, four arrows. That's going to allow me to um, drag and resize this object. So I'm going to move it up to the top left and I'm actually going to make it a little bit smaller just so that I think it looks a little better. Now from here I can hit the four arrows again. We're done and that's moved to where I want it to be. I can also change the audio. So right now the audio is off just because it's a picture-in-picture -picture object. But say I want this audio running instead of my main audio. I just have to change the slider then tap on the main thing and change that slider to off. Now I changed the audio to the picture in picture object if you wanted to do so. And finally under video you can still change the speed and split picture in picture objects if you so desire. Now some advice if you don't want to do a picture in picture object you decided I actually want to go and do kind of like a split screen there is an option over on the bottom I just tap that and you can choose how you want to split. So it would either be left and right like it is now, or the opposite way, right and left. You could do up and down, so the top half and the bottom, or uh, once again the other way around. I'm going to keep it this way. I think this looks pretty good. It seems to get both shots in. And uh, from here, you could always go to the magnifying glass and uh, proportionalize this video so it gets the correct spot in the split screen just in case they got that wrong. And of course, I could zoom in um, on the split screen if I wanted to. So it's actually really simple and uh, this way you can get the shot that you want in iMovie. So we hope you have enjoyed this tutorial from HowToDoTech.com. If you have any questions, please leave them down in a comment below or you can email us at HowToDoTechYT at gmail.com. We are also on Facebook and Google Plus, so if you have any questions, you can always ask us there. And feel free to circle us or like the page. You can also click on our YouTube channel to look at more content we have created or click on one of the icons right now on the screen to go to those playlists to see more tutorials. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. I am Alex Bavulsic and I will see you next time.